Hello and welcome back to another episode of Three Layers by Chortbark. I think today we'll we'll tackle this tower. I think I think I should be able to do it. I, I wonder if it's worth it to like dig around these little areas because they seem kind of random. Uh, so that might be just there might be iron or something in there, or just more coal. Maybe it's just the, the three different or four different blocks: dirt, um, double slab, cobber, coal. That might be it too. Uh, it's probably not worth it to light this up because I really haven't seen any natural mob spawns yet. So maybe there aren't any. So yeah, I want to go around a little bit as to not sp you know I don't want to spawn too many mobs in the tower before we get there. So we'll we'll take it you know right around it and then I'll try to rush for the door and see how bad things are. It might be really bad and it might be a bad idea to try that. But I always want to give the the map makers a benefit of the doubt. Oh, and it looks like there's looks like there's land out there. I'm not. Can you see that? If, if I do it like this, is it too dark? It might be too dark on YouTube, but I can see see grass over there. Uh, it looks like a super flat world with like it's one layer bedrock and then maybe five layers, six layers dirt. <laughs> yeah, I can see it over there too. I've noticed. Have not noticed that before. Oh yeah, and that's probably the way down that we see down. I don't know if you can see that. It's so hard just to tell what's too dark. Oh, yeah, two floor two. This guy has a weird expression <laughs> on his face. Oh yeah, I can even see a village down there. <laughs> that's always fun. Uh, so that's like soul sand, lapis, and that might be cyan and blue clay on the way down. I'm not sure if that tells us anything. This is very green and has a lot of zombies. Uh, so judging by that, I'm not sure what to expect down there. Blue, I don't know. <laughs> and up above is white. So maybe lots of skeletons and ghasts, and down there maybe... witches and... I mean... There's not really much else. Maybe underwater stuff? Guardians? No, that doesn't make any sense. It's always fun to speculate though. Uh, so that's what I'm doing here. <laughs> I have no basis for, for any of that. It's just this is green and it has zombies. So I assume that there would be some kind of color coding going on. Okay, pig spawner. Okay. So far, so good. I hear already some guys falling on top of me. That's not. That's not what I want to hear. Yeah, that's lots of zombies falling. That's not great. That's not a good sound. Oh yeah, that's not that's not nice. Uh, is that a slime spawner? That would also fit into the green theme. So maybe maybe these mobs are color coded. I'm not sure how safe I am right here, but I feel pretty safe on this ladder. Uh, can't get any light up there, come on. Let's, let's break some spawners here. I actually don't even know what difficulty I'm on, never checked. I didn't change it, it's what it, you know, to what it was set. This might be normal. Feels like it's normal, but I have, I don't know, maybe it's easy. I hope it's not. So and then I would like to change it. And I feel like I'm already kind of late for that. That's not, that's not, that's not smart. It's much better to do this. I might have to leave and come back, because there's lots of stuff above me now. I didn't know these guys could climb down ladders. I guess he tried to fall down and just that just happened, kind of. Who knows. Uh, coal and golden apple, very nice. Same thing again. I'll take that. I feel the need to leave now. 
Because I hear, oh, I left these guys alive, these spawners. Let's get rid of them. They might be spawning outside or something. I hear lots and lots of zombies. I feel very scared. Uh, beetroot soup doesn't stack. That sucks. Some poison arrows. I don't know why I feel the need to take this chest and not the other two, but... Okay. Oh, this guy has an iron sword. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. <laughs> they hit me for 10 hearts or something. That hurt. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I, I'm not worried about the difficulty anymore. This seems hard enough. Okay, I saw a spawn up there. Oh, wow. Look at all these zombies. That's pretty crazy. That's a chest down there too. I've missed so far. That's not all that. Ah, I wanted to block them off right away, but I was too slow. That was not very, very well played at all. <laughs> wow. Okay. So that's trouble. That guy with the sword. I have to rewatch that. How much damage did he deal? Like I might. I don't think I had my four hearts up. Oh yeah, that's, there are lots of spawns up top. I should have checked that out, I guess. I should have. I, what I should have done is leave quicker. Like when, once I got to that level of the whatever, what was it? Four spawners and the two chests. I should have just broken those and then left right away. Cause man, <laughs> that guy wrecked me. I feel like other than that, I would have been fine. Maybe not, but it feels like I would have been. Uh, now I need to figure out how to kill these guys off without spawning too many new ones. Uh, does poison work on undead mobs? I don't know. I think so. I think it's just like healing or like uh, harming heals them, but I don't think like that. I don't think poison is like a. Yeah, I don't think poison is like region and region is like poison for them. I think it's just it's just harming and health that are reversed for undead mobs. But I might be wrong. I might be wrong about that. Um, I um, I don't know what these scars are really for. <laughs> I guess I can wear them as a helmet. I don't really care about that. How much is a bow? I don't remember. Yeah, no, I don't remember. I'm really low now, it sucks. I'm no no good way to to heal back up unless I buy some potions to weapon out. Sixteen core for bow, that feels like it's worth it. Um, let's buy half a stack of arrows. Maybe I should buy some armor too. Yeah, I'm definitely not buying that shield though. <laughs> uh, 12, 8, I'm just short. One core short. Um, how much were the health potions actually? The boiler has them. 16 core for instant health 2. Or 4 iron. I don't know. I don't want to die. I mean, it's probably fine dying, but I don't want to. Uh, let's see, how do I approach this now? It seems like most of them despawned. That's that's good. Because there were way too many. It's very quiet now. Ah, so close to that tree. Do I want to build up? What? Oh, I hit the corner or oh, the the edge. I forget. I always forget about that. <laughs> There's a way to take four damage on the on slime blocks. Um, it's really unfortunate that that's a, that's a thing. I think let's actually eat one app right, and then and 
and then yeah. Oh yeah, and I've, yeah. So the absorption doesn't override absorption two. It's a weaker effect, so it doesn't get rid of my four hearts. Okay, so there's a spawn somewhere down here as well. So that was not great. But I guess a little bit of fire damage is fine as long as I have my shield up. Doesn't really matter all that much. I kind of don't like the hidden spawners. Um, I guess it's not that big of a deal, at, you know, in this map, because there aren't there aren't any natural spawns, um, and there aren't like any crazy spawners at least so far. But in general, I'm not a big fan of of like completely hidden spawns. I always feel like I should be a hint as to where they are. Uh, like some some kind of different block or something that makes me go oh wow well, that's suspicious and then okay that's not very good I'm, gonna, I'm spawning stuff above me again. Close that off. Are there any more holes? I don't see any, so that's good at least. Okay, so no, that's not a hole, because that's where the ladder is. And. Yeah, okay, that's fine. That's pretty crazy. What? Okay. What? I'm getting pushed up. That's not great. Uh, how do I escape this? I don't. The answer, I think. Yeah, I don't. Ah, what happened? Like the the baby zombie went down through me and then pushed me back up from below, and I couldn't get off the ladder. <laughs> that was really stupid. That was a stupid death. I'm kind of embarrassed by that. What I should have done is try it. Uh, I should have tried to break the spawners through the floor and then cleaned up the zombies, and not tried to clean them up and then get rid of the spawners. Uh, and all my stuff, or half my stuff, is probably up there now. At least we have backup gear. That was that was terrible. <laughs> I wasted my potion too. Ah, so bad, so bad. I didn't grab any blocks. I don't want to go without them though. Ah, yeah, I definitely should not have died there. That was bad. I didn't, I, I don't know, for some reason I thought it would be not, no problem. I thought this, the baby zombie would go down and then that would be it. Um, I didn't think I'd, he could push me up through the other zombies. But that's what happened. I definitely did not hit any keys there other than shift. I have way too much stuff on me. That's fine, that's fine. We can, we can deal with that in a bit. Okay, the, what am I missing? My arrows are still not here. I kind of want to get rid of that spawner, but I have no idea where it is. It's right here. I'm blind. Okay. Are my arrows down here or are they up on the tower? It definitely felt like some stuff fell uh, onto the tower, not down with me. But who knows. Okay, now the disc. Probably should bring that back, but I don't, I don't know. I won't. Sword is almost broken. Maybe I should conserve that. <laughs> 
Ah, there's iron around, I'll be fine. I think. I'm just gonna rely on that. Where's that spawn? It has to be... Where is it? Over here? <laughs> I hate hidden spawners. No, I don't see any particles. <laughs> okay, my arrows. Half a stack of arrows. That's... I think that's all I'm missing. I hope I'm not forgetting anything important. Could have like gone under here, maybe. No, so they'll probably be upstairs. <sighs> so bad. What oh, is the spawn on the still on here? That's that's where those guys were spawning from. <laughs> Outside the tower. This might still not be very smart. Uh, as an approach here. Is this still... Oh, there's still so many things above me. Okay. Oh, I think I'm missing two iron ingots too. That sucks. Okay, what do I do about that? Yeah, that's my stuff right there. I did see... Ah, stupid ladder. I don't know how to do this. That's my water bucket. That I don't do one back because I don't know. Yeah, that I got that. Did I get anything else? No. There's a spawner right here. <laughs> I feel like I'm not playing very well at the moment. How did that guy hit me? His feet? There's no way his arms can reach me. I still don't have my arrows. So I still f it still doesn't feel like I've made a dent into the spawning and these guys hitting me while falling and not even being able to hit me actually is kind of annoying. Okay, let's do the same thing on this side I guess. Kind of same thing at least. That's not safe at all what I'm doing. Got some light up there. This should be pretty good now, right? I mean, I still hear quite a few zombies, but that's ah, too slow. Should put the torch down over there. <laughs> I think my arrows are gone. Ah, I've wasted so much material, so many materials now for this. Potion, the arrows, that's not great. That's not what I meant to do, this is what I meant to do. And then this, and then this. And this. I actually wanted to get some light up there, but there doesn't seem to be a way. <laughs> this is bad. Come over here, guys. I'm wasting so much time here. How can these guys hit me while falling? It doesn't make any sense. Like, once they're down, they can't, but while they're falling, they can't. Minecraft is weird. How many are left? Am I still spawning new ones? It doesn't feel like I should be. Of course, it's right there. Potato, that's nice, maybe? I mean, I don't have any bones for bone meal or anything like that. 
okay, at least we got this done. That was bad. I should have I should have gone in from the top really. It would have made things much easier. So much XP down there, we need to get out of that. Um Okay, so water Barrier blocks, okay. So I, okay, that's so that I can't. Yeah, I can't go in from the side or the top. I have to come in from here, I guess, to get to this chest. Ooh, this is a nice chest. I like this chest. World cleaver, two of them. Protection five, sharpness four, looting two. I'm breaking a hundred. That's pretty good. Just a one diamond uh, or objective block thing. Very nice. Take the wood. Actually, I'll take that and I'll take this instead of these three. Okay. And then, yeah, barrier blocks all around and above. And presumably in front too, yeah. So no, no way to get to the wood other than the back side here. And then, uh, actually, other barrier blocks on this side. Yeah, you have to come up through here, so you have to actually. That's that's nice. That's uh, I like that. So you can't really cheese it. You have to fight at least a little bit um, to get to get the, the diamond and the good loot. All right, that's a start. That was a horrible. Like I I did a terrible job there though. Like there's no there's no denying that. Let's actually go out this way because I think there were some zombies on the other side. Ah, upgraded sword is very nice to have though. Was a little tunic, some more armor. It's always nice to have. I did not see that guy at all. Oh, but I can't pick it up. Good enough. Okay. So that's that, huh? Man, I did a bad job there. Ah, oh, like I have, I have no excuse even. Like I don't know, maybe I underestimated them up a little bit because it started off really slow, and I thought I was completely in control. And like my instincts told me to bridge it and not go in from the bottom, and I thought, well, whatever, I can do it, you know. <laughs> and that was that was not not a good decision on my part there. Okay. Uh, Leave that. Okay, what can I do with ten iron ingots and a bunch of core? Thirty-nine core. Can I do anything good with that? I guess that's the question now. Yeah, let's just check that before we end this episode. It's kind of long. I should just end it right now. I wanna just run over there real quick. Let's see what we can do. I mean, there's a bunch of core I should grab off camera, probably. Uh, so, yeah, the potions. Okay, okay. Food wise, oh, yeah, we can use planks or core for steak. So, I should definitely do that. I don't know. I, I, feel, I, I think it's that sea lantern or something. It's the second time I've, I've looked over there or glanced over there and thought I saw something that didn't fit. Okay, so we can use core for armor. That's definitely a bad trait. I, I should craft a shield. Um, sharpness 5, I don't really care. Like One more sharpness is not going to make a whole lot of difference. Um, so I don't really care for that. And then the blockman had the... Uh, yeah, enchanting table is 8. And the 16 bookshelves are 8 wood, so that's really, that's pretty cheap. Um, so what do we need? 8, 8 and then 4, 12 iron, if I want to get a stack of bottles of enchanting, I, I, could, I think, I, I don't know if that's enough to get to 30, but it might be. I could just, why well, I killed all the zombie spawns that, I, that I've seen, but... Yeah, if I, if I 
No, the, the dying really hurt me. I lost a lot of levers there, probably. I don't know where I was at. But, yeah. So I guess next episode we will either... I don't know. I might, I might collect some coal and wooden planks off camera so that I can get some gear and then we'll head downstairs to the next floor in the next episode and see what we see what we see there. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you then. Bye bye.